point briefly. I think the point is worth underlining, Tosi Ford, that the arrest right now is not in the case of sexual violence, sexual abuse, what the women are alleging. This is for assault on the ED officials, right? Uh, this is that case. What happens to all of those other cases? And as Kia Ghosh said, earlier your party was not willing to accept those allegations. You said, where is the FIR? Then multiple cases came forth, one including a, a, a section that relates to gang rape. So, you know, when you say Karan Johar, aren't you trivializing the seriousness of these allegations? Bartha, we are very much civilians from day one, you know. And when uh, Kia Ji was talking about the court obstructions or whatsoever, you know, this obstruction and this whole thing was asked by the ED. The ED went there, the ED wanted to investigate and they asked the court that we wanted some kind of obstruction that no one should interfere with Sheikh Shah Jahan's case. So this is very clear, Kia Ji. I mean, you can't deny that. I'm not saying the court went and said that you can't do anything. It was the ED who demanded we don't want any kind of intervention. Wait, I'll, I'll again listen to you. It's a very good debate what's happening and I understand what you want to say. But again, following the Sandesh Thali, saw someone to was incident, said Shah Jahan was the main accused in the attacks on ED officials, right? Cases were registered in the other issues in Sandesh Thali after Feb 8th against Sheikh Shah Jahan. Other people were also named as the accused in these cases. But all these cases was back in two, three years. When you talk about a gimmick, when you talk about an eye wash, here's the I want to request that I want the same eye wash, I want the same facade gimmick or massacre, whatever you want to name, with Vrit Bhushanji as well, with Nirav Modi as well, with Mehul Choksi as well, with Pushpesh Bhatt as well. We want to have this eye wash. But you also took your time. Do I get to respond to this? Do I get to respond to this? Uh, to this humane, okay. to this humane okay. response of Tosi Food. One at a time. Uh, only request is Kia, if you can make your interjection brief, because Zakia and Gargi are waiting. So please go ahead. Sure, sure. I understand. There are two esteemed panelists as well who are waiting. I just wanted to uh, remind very, very politely to my brother Tosi Food that uh, Bridge Bushan Sarans, this case, it is under the Supreme Court. It's a sub matter. So Supreme Court, if the Honorable Court finds him guilty, we won't shield him. Wherein Mamta Banerjee on the floor of because legislature, let me finish. Let me, I can understand your frustration. Yeah. I can very well understand your frustration. Mamta Banerjee on the floor of Vidhan Sabha, she said, we, uh, Sheikh Shah Jahan is being targeted. So she plainly stood beside someone who had been earlier framed of gang rapes and murders and he uh, acted as a sexual predator for more than a decade. Okay. Let's. Did you, did you, did you suspend guys, 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 a request. Hang on, hang on. Now the politicians must let the non politicians speak. Gargi, go ahead. For inviting. Yeah. 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 Am I audible now? Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Barkha, for inviting. And I think Tosifur has a very uh, tough job today to defend the indefensible. <laughs> anyway, Barkha, see, Sheikh Shahzan is not a single case. There are numerous Shandesh Khali like places in Bengal where land grabs have been happening and where this kind of torture on women have been happening. And you know, the greatest quality of Didi or Pishi, she protects her goons till the last moment. So they tried their best. Now they had no other way. He was being under protection. So now they have done this drama. Have you seen Sheikh Shahzan's body language today? Is it the body language of a criminal? It seems that the policemen are not policemen. They are his bodyguards. Just see his body language, Barkha. Ja, you just you are showing the visual and people will understand. Because the police were saluting him till these days. When the women went to the police station, they were asked to go and complain to Sheikh Shah Jahan and his brother Siraj. So that was the situation. And why are these people protected? You have to understand the politics of Bengal. Because these are the monsters. Not only one, Sh Shandesh Kali, go beyond Medinipur. There are a lot of land grabs. These are the people who ensure electoral victory for Didi. These are the people who collect money and the money goes up. Sheikh Shah Jahan has grand la grabbed lands. What about the 35 properties belonging to th the Banerjee family. But what do you make? What do you what do you make of the arrest? What do you make of the arrest? This to they were for this. It's a, he will get five star treatment, Barka. He will re remotely control his place. He has to be handed over to the ED. Otherwise, nothing will happen. 
you can understand from his body language see i will tell you barkha because i know it very well when the violence happened after the post poll in 2021 i made a video on a girl she had to flee her village similar things happened in her village in pandobeshwar area they could not complain in the police station like here on this kali thana naza police station they never took the complaint from the women they said go to shek shahjan so those policemen are they not criminal also shouldn't they be also charged okay. Okay, okay. You you so, raised important question. So this is absolutely, this is absolutely a drama. Absolutely, and you imagine Avishek saying Avishek Banerjee said, "Ki kore chhe Shahjan." So now they were saying, "Ki kore chhe." What has he done? Didi said he is being targeted, and now they are just pushed to the wall. So they are just reacting. Okay, they have left with no option but to react. Is your central argument? Yes. Zakia Soman, Zakia Soman. Women's rights are politicized. trivialized become a battlefield for electoral politics i'm not you know there's a cynicism i feel as a feminist because really the story here too is politics is the it it yeah. I, i i don't i want it to be about the women but the politics will yeah. overtake what's happened to the women your thoughts zakia uh, absolutely barkha uh, it is with lot of sadness and even frustration that you know i'm undergoing a sense of deja vu and i'm sure you are also undergoing a sense of deja vu uh, you know not so long ago we were we were discussing bridge bhushan sharan singh we were discussing remission to rapists before that we were discussing kuldeep sanger and people like that so so what i want to say is our political class as a whole perhaps uh, you know today seem to think that crimes against women are okay you know crimes against although here uh, in sandesh khali it is much more than that it's about corruption it's about misgovernance it's about failure of law and order it's about politics but at the heart of it somewhere it is also persistent sexual harassment of women which nobody feels is important to attend to and time and again we are we are, we are seeing this you know molesters sexual harassers rapists getting away because of their political party affiliations and this doesn't apply to a political party a or b or c i'm i'm sorry to say that all our political parties across the board in india are guilty because this has happened in bjp ruled states it has happened in congress ruled states it's now happening in tmc ruled states uh, state so 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 it is like uh, 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 half the population of india that is the women of india Uh, on the one ho- hand you know every political party is so eager to explore the women women vote so called but on the other hand uh, violence against women and crimes against women are not uh, important political agenda i, 